be one. So, I decided to stop here at the University of Sewanee, the University of the South. Um, I've heard things about it, that it's this awesome place, and it's one of the most beautiful college campuses, and uh, I was just so happy to be in the area, so I thought I'd take a look. And so far, it is stunning, actually. The architecture is amazing. So that was the Convocation Hall, and I think straight ahead, that beautiful building, with the spire in the middle, is the Dining Hall. Oh my goodness, I am a sucker for like courtyards. That I think they're awesome. Especially these kind of walked walkways around them. Gives me that Oxford, you know, type feel. Ah, beautiful. Let's see if we can get into the dining area here. See if it's open today. Pardon me, sorry. Okay. I don't think that was the dining room. <laughs> I think that was like uh, the big you know, faith center, the whole, maybe that's the dining room over there, but uh, whoops. Beautiful, beautiful campus, my goodness. So that chapel back there was All Saints Chapel, which is kind of, the reason I came, that's the kind of the big building here on campus that you're supposed to look out for and kind of the most popular one. Uh, I, I gets kind of stumbled onto it. I didn't realize that's what I was looking at. Um, so I'm kind of just walking around one of the green areas of the space here. And I gotta say these buildings, just when you put all this extra attention into it, the rock work, decorative work, just makes every building that much more interesting. So. That's the dining hall back there. They didn't have to do all that extra little work around the windows, and but it just makes everything so more more interesting, you know, and beautiful. And uh, I don't know, there's something that draws you draws you to it. And uh, it's nice they put this little kind of park area in this courtyard. Uh, I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just kind of walking around now, looking for pretty buildings <laughs> and uh, finding them. So this looks like a newer hall. It's called Spencer Hall. I have no idea. I mean, it looks new, but just the old time kind of lighting, putting Spencer Hall kind of in there. Look at the, I don't know what you call that, corning or just the embellishments. Could be a regular brick building, right? But you have all these little embellishments that, uh, man, make me miss the university. Uh, it just screams money, of course, right? <laughs> it costs money to do that. Uh, but it costs vision, too, I think, right? you got to have to have the vision to spend the money on that because, of course, there's always people asking you to spend it elsewhere. And um, I think these are lasting beauties, right? They can contribute to the overall health of the campus. Just look at kind of the castle brick motif here. I like the way that light pops out from the other stuff. There's a smaller chapel there called St. Luke's Chapel. And then there's this small building here. I have no idea what it is. <laughs> Uh, but that's pretty much the entire trip, round trip here. What a beautiful little campus. Reminds me of like a mix of Notre Dame and Wheaton College to some extent. But 
All right, that will do it.